Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Big Tuna here, back here at Headwaters Junction's maintenance facility, doing a little bit more work. Finally got the uh, pan started to lay down, and I uh, got them, got them as you can see, welded in. Uh, the Lincoln rep uh, told me that the best thing to use for rusted material is ProStar S6. I'm using 035 wire, and oh my goodness, I mean, that's a decent looking well considering along through there especially right there i mean that, that's awesome i mean yeah the loose scale i had to uh had to get off of it then i just took a wire wheel quickly across it but man i mean it just it's phenomenal how it works and i'm real pleased with that and um coming along real good got my gaps that i wanted there to where i could put a put a fill weld in there and get all three pieces the tube and then the two pieces of gauge material uh, welded together and everything kind of got a little hairy right there a little bit uh they really didn't notice this until after i started attacking it in there and was like uh oh well i'll just take a uh, cut off wheel on a small grinder and uh, make my own gap in there and uh, finish welding that off but the center bar there is to get my elevation up off of the uh the main frame of the uh, rail car to keep my elevation looking good but uh so far so good and uh there's some more of the welds back in there how well you can tell that they are but uh, they're real decent yeah they get a little bit of spatter but hey it's better than the alternative that's for sure of grinding down into nothing but good material and everything but uh I've, i'm making headway now it seems like and uh, uh i've got one more panel here i'm sure probably tomorrow or maybe the middle of next week i'll get over here and uh, get this other panel finished up and then uh, start coming back through and uh, removing these. And that's some of the spots where I told you they had plug welded the panels down and everything. And I just cut around them to gain access to them and come back to them later on. But uh, yeah, so far so good. And um, before uh, I end this video, it's going to be another little short one here. Um, I would love it if you would uh, like, share, and comment. And uh, again, I'll do my best to uh, get back with you on any comments or any suggestions that you may have on that and yeah there's that other side not looking forward to it because it is a lot of work it seems like it's more work ripping up the old floor than it is putting the new down but uh, it is what it is okay i'm back and uh, here's a top view of the train car of uh, what they're anticipating it to look like and um I told you in the very first video that the bathroom was going to be at the other end, and it is not. Uh, this is the end that I'm working on right now. This is going to be the restroom and stuff. So they've changed the things uh, around, but uh, who knows? Um, it could change by the time everything is said and done. So, and then uh, here is uh, the uh, depot that they're wanting to... Uh, to put out there as well which is right down the road um, came out of Ohio there's some some photos of it and everything and then there's from what you can read of it I'll go down through here real slow and this was also purchased uh, to put out there at Headwaters Junction. Um, here is the current state of it. It's, uh, it's been neglected for some time, but they plan on picking that up, bringing it, I don't know, three quarters of a mile down the road, and then setting it, setting it back over in there and uh, refurbishing it so that way they're out of the weather and everything like that. But uh, I don't know if I had run over it. I don't think I have. But uh, this is the welder that I have purchased. Um, I am not endorsed by Lincoln. Lincoln didn't donate this to me or anything. This is just a shout out to Lincoln on what a wonderful machine. That's 110 or 220. Uh, no flipping of switches or anything like that. Uh, you can plug it into 110, pull it out, change, change the pigtail right here. Uh, over to the 110 pigtail and plug it in and turn it on and it goes uh, awesome awesome and uh, there's the uh, cabinet and everything so far I'm pleased on uh, 
on the way the cabinet's working so far, it's, it's uh, satisfied my needs. And I like it to where I can pick that welder up and take it and set it in the car there and uh, use it, then bring it back out here and get it covered back up. So I do appreciate you guys uh, watching my videos and sharing them and everything else. Uh, please like, share, and comment again. Uh, this is Big Tuna. Peace, love, and chicken grease. I'm out.